Okay. Let's do this. to talk to my entrepreneurs. We're gonna moms, dads, aunts, uncles, grandmas, whatever it is, okay? These last few months have been challenging for all of us and if you're like me, your stress has just gone up. So, one tip, that's all I got. One easy tip for you to help lower that stress, just a little bit. Okay, so we can make life a little bit more manageable. A plan. And yes, I have two. Actually, I have three. I know, right? You might think it's overkill, but it's really not because they do different functions, okay? And this one is kind of my snapshot, okay? I look at this and I'm like, oh, I've got to do this coming up this day, okay? I put you know, my boy's school schedule, doctor's appointments, things like that, okay? That's this one. This is monthly and weekly, okay? So I can break things down into a monthly and a weekly. So I can look at it and be like, okay, what do I have coming up this week? When does my husband work? Do we have any plans? Are we going to the mountains? Whatever, okay? This one, right here, okay? That's what this one is for. This one, as you can tell, it's a little bit heftier, okay? This is a monthly as well and daily and the daily portion is broken up into hours a to-do list my top three most important that i have to do there's a section for gratitude notes um things that i need to do tonight to get me ready for tomorrow however i want to use that section okay this one here is my daily this one i literally check every single day to say okay what do i have going on today what do i need to get done what is my top priority as long as I get those top three things done, I can call my day a success. And it lowers your stress just a little bit. Having a place to write it all out. These two here, I've linked down below, okay? And if you want a little bit more, then just go get a planner, honestly. I mean, seriously, we also need to do self-care, okay? So pick one or both, get them both, whichever, okay? Use them both, but also find some me time. What are you doing for you? And I'm sorry, moms, because I'm probably gonna make some of you mad. I don't care though. A target run, and I was guilty of this too for the longest time, I really was. A target run, that's not self-care. Yeah, it's nice to get away, have some solitude, maybe get a cup of coffee. That, that I will consider some self-care because obviously I like my coffee. I started the video drinking some, okay? So go to Target, no, not self-care. But you get your favorite cup of coffee while you're there. Maybe you walk around, you find some fun little decorations or knickknacks, whatever it might be, okay? You found something there. I will maybe, maybe small, okay? Consider that cup of coffee some me time, okay? But find something else too. Your nails done, guys, I'm sorry, I know that one's probably not for you. Go for a walk, whatever it could be. But Target Run, let's stop saying not self-care, mom. Let's stop saying me time. It's not. Yes, it's quiet time. It's away from the kids, the spouse, the significant other, whatever else is going on at home or this that you need a break from, okay? Yes, go do your target run. But please don't count that your me time. Find something else too. Read a book, take a hot bath, go for a walk, have a glass of wine, or a mocktail, whatever your passion is, I don't judge, okay? Do something for you though, okay? And let's stop saying target runs. Target runs are fun we do walk around we have fun we see pretty things Ooh, I want that someday I want this someday I want that someday yes I get it okay enjoy that cup of coffee while you're there walk around look at all the things be like oh I can picture that in my living room or how about that mm-hmm right okay yes go to Target but don't count it your me time okay 
find something else that is your me time because that's a necessity. They have groceries and clothes and things like that. Like that's a necessity. That's something we kind of have to do. Well, we don't have to do it at Target, but let's be honest. Target has pretty things. I'm guilty, right? Okay. But don't count it your me time. Okay. But take a load off, get a planner, make your lists, at least get it out of your head and onto a piece of paper. It doesn't even have to be a planner. But just get it out of your head and onto something. Dry erase boards are great too. I love those. If you want more information, check out my blog. I've got it down below for you, okay? Five easy steps of how you can lower your stress and even some suggestions for me time, okay? So, what are you gonna do? Tell me, seriously, I wanna know. What's your me time? Let me know. Let me know if I can help. If I can help you brainstorm some ideas of what you can do for me time, okay? Drop me some comments, let me know. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, and I'll see you again soon, okay?